Hello and welcome back to more LEGO Harry Potter, my name is Zeppelin G993 and in this part I am Deadless Diggle, showing that you can be a proper wizard and still wear a dashing burgundy top hat. You know, people sort of forget Deadless Diggle, but I think he's, his sense of loyalty to Harry Potter, I think that's really admirable to be honest. So I thought I'd give him a go in this part as we do level 5, no actually level 4, sorry, level 4 of year 7 part 2. And I'm keeping an eye on the recording this time because I have been fiddling about the settings and the wires, so hopefully my capture card is not going to give me any any reasons to go ah to be angry and that sort of thing you know one can hope anyway so we'll see how this part goes <laughs> uh, so yeah I mean Sierra Franks was saying in the comments that she, she thinks it's just this game that's having the problems it, but if that's the case I hope so because I mean, I mean we're getting towards the end of this game now so it doesn't really matter too much anyway in, in that sense if it is um, and also someone else was saying I think it was Golden Dragon saying about when are you going to do Harry Potter PC? After this project's finished, I'll have a go at Philosopher's Stone for PC. And that's going to be interesting, is all I'm going to say about that. So here we are, this guy sucking around his lolly. How, how can he suck on a lollipop when there's so much evil and hatred and suffering going on in the world at the moment? And he's just thinking, oh yeah, I'm going to suck a lolly. Do my thing. So it's like, um, for this level sort of in, in like eight, no, four sections. And there's two collectibles per section as it were. Um, so it's quite nicely um, it's, quite easy, it's quite nicely broken up and you need to get 80,000 studs to get um, true wizard so you have to really get every single one which isn't a bad thing necessarily really. <laughs> the f for here though we just need to focus on just getting this bad boy sorted just getting through the level. Looking out for the dark wizard object. Dark wizard objects obviously you know Always a good sign that there's something there for us to get. One of Hermione on another romantic date. Like, ah, oh, Hermione. <laughs> oh, look at this. It's the room of all forgotten things. Oh. How romantic we're on life, also, too. Yes. Look, look, fireworks in the sky. Oh. But the eyes, your, your eyes, they remind me of a startled deer. <laughs> I don't know. Get his fan. He's his biggest fan. Yeah, you see what I did there? These. There we go. So now we can get all this together. Easy peasy, little squeezy. But yeah, just keep an eye on studs and try and get as many as you can. Because there's plenty of sections where they, they just throw loads at you. And I, I found that as long as you do get all the studs, as long as you just make sure that you do get them when they uh, when they appear. Which sounds really obvious, but you can sometimes just be like, oh well, you know. Like here for example, just get as many as you can here. Big sweep them all around. Lovely jubbly. So we're on 10,000 already, so that's not too bad by all accounts. <laughs> in there, no. Just in there maybe. Here we go, the first, the first collectible, that dark object looking out for us. There we go, so we've got Dollar Hob in his work uniform. The alternative gear for the uh, for Death Eaters. <laughs> when they're letting their hair down. I'd feel really bad if I was a dollar hob here. I'd just be like, oh, looking all. I'm a serious death eater. Yeah, I've got real world issues that are really affecting me, and I'm here doing this. Why on earth is it not working? Go on. Why oh, can't I let, let me down? We need a fireman here. That's what we need. There we go. Let me get the quest piece. Right, go on, Hermione. Before dollar hob curses you. And that's not good. So the next collectible is a student in peril, and that's towards. It's pretty obvious, student in peril. You, 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 you spot them a mile off, as they're always in peril, funnily enough. <laughs> oh, the awkward section here with the blooming. These things. Ooh. Go on then, get back to the night. Whoa! <laughs> Go on, Miney. Levitate me! Levitate me, girl! That's a bit weird. <laughs> Some sort of crazy turn on. There you go. <laughs> the best way to make any character look less threatening is give them a pair of those. Whatever the Spectra Specs? I was going to call them Omnoculars, but they're not Omnoculars, aren't they? That's a different book. <laughs> Hermione, don't do it, Hermione, no, Hermione, no, Hermione! Oh my god, you risk taking Hermione. She's crazy, she is sometimes. She just goes for it. 
Oh my god, come on now. Let's start, 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 start. Must get every single last stud available. It's not too bad, 20,000 nearly in, in, in this section. So here there is a skeleton, and um, that's another collectible which you finish off in the next part of the level. You have to get three skeletons and make them dance, because, you know, nothing makes the mood a bit happier. And it's like, I know we've got to kill the Dark Lord and get rid of all kinds of things, but look, dancing skeleton, that's amazing! Um, so over here is shooting Impel, like, uh, hello, I'm kind of in trouble here. Been here like five years. There we go. Shooting him pal. Happy, happy, happy. And he can run away and get killed by a Death Eater. Oh, what a waste. <laughs> no, hopefully not didn't happen. We live in hope. So that's the first two collectibles for this section. Relatively straightforward. Watch you know where they are. I mean, yeah. Oh, and over there, as you probably saw that there, just a little glimpse of the eye. A purple one there. They get that. Things will be just easy, easy peasy, studs wise. It's still possible to it's still possible to do it without the purple one, but this makes it a hell of a lot easier. So just get it right there. Right for diadem. Ah yes, diadem, diadem, diadem. There's plenty of cool little things to get here. Two more collectibles in this little section here. First of all, this chest. Get another one of those skeletons for us. And that will come into use later on as well. Da, 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 da. So let me have some fun. Um, this isn't the last skeleton either, I'm afraid. Um, this is another cool little collectible for us to get here, which gets us some more studs. It's nice to do anyway. Let's put him into it, and oh my good lord, he's alive! And they're both dancing. Like, why defeat bad guys when you can just dance? Lovely jam. Actually, no, I'm, I'm gonna ruin it for them now. I'm sorry, guys, your fun is up. I want your studs. <laughs> I want your money. It would be pretty cool, actually, in these games if you could play some of the other members of Georgia the Phoenix, you know. Because they're meant to be helping out and defending the school as well, like Remus and Tom. Oh, actually, Remus could be a bit awkward because he dies up, doesn't he? Spoiler alert. <laughs> so over here, get Fang. You need to get into this area. Not only does this have a collectible for just, just in general, this also has the uh, the second, never no, last, in fact, uh, the skeletons. The dancing skeletons. The dancing to go bump in the night. And. Isn't that just lovely? Look at that, it's a little troll. Mm. It's like a nightmare, that is. Isn't a troll with them in a... Like that. Jeez, there is. Although it would be a lot, lot less threatening if it came into the school like... Fancy get up, Mr. Troll. Oh, you think so? I, I, I thought it was, it was my colour. There we go. So those those... That's those two done. Let's get quick shanks out. Come on, man. He's just in there the entire time, like, God, it's so cramped in here. Fine, I can stretch my legs. I can run around and be free. And he goes, No, come back here. I go, Oh. That's so much fun. Oh. Lost face studs. Oh, well. And now, oh, my good lord, now everything's gone crazy. There's fire everywhere. <laughs> Like how, how can we make this level really threatening and scary? Fire! Fire everywhere! So yeah, this first level here is pretty darn obvious. Just grab this dark cage. Dark cage. Dark Lord is a dark cage. There he is. Here's the explanatory. And there you go, that's the quest piece. Quest piece is all done. We made done. So now we're just going to get the characters and the... Uh, yeah, it's just characters now, actually. It's quite, it's it's quite weird how they sort of, how they split it up this time, actually. How it's all, uh, all the quest pieces early on, and then you do the characters. But I'm not complaining. Something different. Oh, good lord! Come on, all the studs. Well, most of them anyway. Get up here quickly. Money run. Mine, get up here quickly before the dragon. 
Good lord, Hermione, 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 oh, Hermione's dead. Oh well. People will remember her. Oh, she's there. Okay, thank god. Jeez the reason, Hermione, I thought you were dead. Right, prepare to do your thing. And get some Gregory Goyle. Well, I did feel a little bit sad for actually in this part, because because this game especially makes him look like he's, you know, he was repenting, almost as it were, you know, he was, uh, he'd seen the error of his ways. Which is fair enough when you're uh, faced with lots of fire. You're like, actually, uh, I think I made a boo boo. <laughs> I'm killing off my clone twin. <laughs> but they just stand there, though. It's, 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 impossible, it's impossible not to hurt those characters. They just stand there so awkwardly, like, oh my god, my life. Stats, 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 stats. As you can see, we're doing pretty well. Although the last section is really small actually, so it does make sense to get as many here as you can. And the sooner you sort it out, the better really. There's less for you to worry about later on in the level. Especially when, because you know, it's so awkward when you get to the end of the level and you haven't got enough and you're just looking around like, oh my god, there's got to be some studs here. Especially when you're trying. It's alright if, if you don't really care, but when you're actually trying to get them. Alright, come on Arthur, do your thing. Rocket. I'm amazed that it doesn't just go off by itself, really. The amount of fire everywhere. Perfect atmosphere to destroy everything. Oh my good lord, there we go. Can't just bounce up there because that'd be too easy. It's one of the most awkward of these things ever. Oh my god, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. You know what to do with that analog stick. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Dear, dear. There we go, climbing out of the fire because we're all groovy. After my dragon is going around, I quick aggromenti it. But that's not going to work, guys. We're doomed, oh my god. No, we're not. <laughs> now we've got to save their paltry hides. Oh dear. Ridiculous. And there we go, true wizard. Already! I've already just started this section. Beautiful. Let's breeze through this one now. Goes up, why the hell not? Um, so, when I get on this, you might as well do uh, collectibles first. They're sort of towards the back of this section, if you, if you know what I mean. So, if you go back towards the corner here, you'll find two more sections. Here's the first one. Get this chest open. Malfoy and Karagor, or Goyle and Zabini, rather. That's like, what on earth are you doing? What the blimmin' heck are you doing? We're dying over here, we're burning in the fire. Like, sorry, but Tom Riddle, cat a token. Obviously, you know, priorities. Jeez, guys. Back on the broomstick. That cat is just being, like, changing all kinds of things. Here's the other one, so you get half away to do his thing. Watch out for the flaming dragon coming around. The chimera. There it is. <laughs> oh my god. Loads and loads of stuff. And there we go. Harry in brown jacket. Super mature Harry. That's like the iconic look from Jeffy Harry's isn't it? Harry in his brown jacket. Like, yeah, I'm a man now. I've got a brown jacket. What the earth is that? That was a panda. It's quite, oh, it's quite cute. And there's a purple one there as well. If you wish to get 100,000, because you're crazy like that. Right. That's all done now. It's all collectibles. True wizard. Everything. Let's get this level. Romeo done. Save their poultry hides. There we go. Come on, Harry. Your listening thing. Listen to the snake. Listen to the snake. Uh, listen, 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 listen to the snake. There we go. He listened to the snake. He got himself a hose. What a crazy kind of a board is that? Right. Seriously, like I, I imagine uh, Mr. Weasley would be so proud of Harry and wanted to see them sort of making, you know, these crazy items. Getting involved in muggle pursuits, like engineering and that kind of thing. Right. Last one here. Bang, bang, bang. 
every game needs a big bang. Like, Harry, what's your advice? What's your strategy? Just bang! Bang everything! Not in that way, one. Leave Jenny alone. <laughs> Me and Hermione. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they right. Get on the plane. Like, at this point, Malpo must be like, Harry, what on earth are you doing, Potter? Having all the fun, basically. I'm Harry Potter, I get to do it wherever, wherever I want. I will save your poultry hide if I want to. That is my choice. I must say, last night for me as well, it was. Oh, it's horrible. The weather's been proper rough here recently. It was how, winds were howling last night, rain was thundering down. I was thinking we need some sort of silencing spell. That's what I need in my life, just to block out all that. God, to be a witch or wizard. And oh my god, they saved me today. Whoop! And there we go. Level done! <laughs> House quests. Check. Goyle. Tom Riddle. High Potter and Brown Jacket. Triple check. True wizard. Mike check. Mike check. And more studs than you can shake a phoenix at. <laughs> So yeah, getting really close towards the end. I'm hoping there wasn't any glitches in that part. I was keeping an eye on my recording software, and everything seems to be a okay Obviously, I won't know properly until I actually start editing this. But you know, crossing my fingers, we live in hope. So the next part then, as you probably guessed, we're going to be doing level 5. Which of course, involves Snape, and it's very sad, very emotional. But we're really coming towards the end. In both, and all my projects actually coming towards the end, which is fantastic news. It's good to sort of round them off. So the next part, yeah, level uh, year seven, part two, level five. See you then. Okay, I promise you, whatever this looks like, there's a perfectly good explanation for this. You may or may not be aware that I am absolutely mad about cycling, and hopefully, this get up clarifies that for you as well.